أسعد الله أوقاتكم مشاهدينا الكرام وأهلا وسهلا بكم في حلقة جديدة مع برنامج رواد الأعمال كما عودناكم في كل حلقة أن نستضيف رجل أعمال مميز معنا اليوم مستر سورنجا من ديليش كلاود ريستورانت هلا مستر سورنجا هلا فرست أوف أول ثانك يو فور بيينغ وذ أس إن أور بروجرام أند وي وونت تو نو مور أباوت يو أند أباوت يور بيجينينغ وذ يور ريستورانت All right. Actually, I really like to you know uh, meet you all because uh, it's very new uh, experience for us. Somebody like professionals like you and come and uh, discussing the things that we are coming up with the idea to uh, have a restaurant and especially Sri Lankan restaurant. So we are here to uh, cater the people who love Sri Lankan food, and we have main dishes like uh, fried rice, kothu roti, and those kind of uh, taste. Some people actually never experience in their life. They have to visit Sri Lanka or some other countries to uh, restaurant like this. So in business way, we have this because uh, we have got a lot of inquiries that how we can find those uh, tastier food in this area. So that's why Delhi Cloud came into the picture. And uh, basically, we are here like last one year, and we got a lot of response from uh, Europeans and other nationalities other than Sri Lankans. So we love to give our uh, Sri Lankan taste. With international cuisines, that's the main idea. Wonderful. So, would you please tell us more about type of dishes, the main dishes you have here, and what's your signature dishes? Actually, uh, we have uh, banana leaf wrapping rice and curry. That is a Sri Lankan traditional food. It's come with all ingredients like uh, you can have with chicken and beef. You want mutton, some that's something like that. And also, we have called kothu roti. That is actually street food in Sri Lanka, but When it comes to this part of world, this is a lovely food because people love that taste, and it is not that much spicy. It's very uh, mild spicy we are using, and also we know the international taste. So what happened? We mix those things into one dishes. That is our signature dishes. That is called kothu roti. So that you also can order. Wonderful. So Mr. Suranga, after all of this success you reach, what's your future plans and what's your vision for your restaurant? Actually, uh, I have got a different idea. I want people to earn passive income from food industry. So I have created a system called E&E, that is Eat and Earn concept. That is going to be live very soon, and I want people to uh, participate as a unit holders, and then they can earn money from the delivery or the food ordering that going through the app. That they can earn money. So that I link to Delhi Cloud Restaurant Management. We are offering. Like uh, unit, so then people can buy the unit and online wherever you live. And end of the day, you can see from dashboard how much uh, food deliver from this company and that company, that restaurant. Everything is visible in your dashboard. End of the day, you can earn money from that. So if somebody willing to get passive income, we are very open and we have created a system and very high tech system to. Give you chance to earn money from food industry. It is a growing business actually. It's amazing idea. We hope you the best and the success for this idea. Thank you, Mr. Suranga. As a businessman, what's your advice for anyone who want to open his own business here in Dubai? First advice: If you have any idea, don't hesitate to implement it, and also don't procrastinate, because then your idea will die. So you have to make them in life, and be careful with your. Surrounding regulations, then only you can get the advice from other legal authorities, and then you come up with the idea and make it. Don't go behind unknown people and don't give money to other people. They say that I will do, I will do. Don't trust them. Go for official regulated places. You can do everything in Dubai. Dubai is very free, and Dubai is very good country. Any businessman allowed to start business in Dubai because they have flexibility and they have security and also very good political background. So they can control everything. The safety is there. So for business people, this is the like gold mine. They can do. They can. They can go their business step by step without any hesitations. At the end, we want to thank you, Mr. Soranga, and we want to tell everyone who want to try Sri Lankan food how they can reach and contact with their with your restaurant. Yes, actually, when you pass Dubai Mall, because people know Dubai Mall, people know Burj Khalifa. When you pass the Dubai Mall, it will be in your right hand side. But as soon as you pass the Dubai Mall, you can see Dubai Canal. So after that beautiful canal, you can see a building called Windsor Manor Building. That Windsor Manor Building, the ground floor behind the canal side. 
so anybody can if you are surrounding in uh, business bay downtown somewhere you can come here otherwise we have link with all the aggregators so whatever delivery app you use you go and check the cloud app there's a menu you can order that you can get discount and you can see all the images you can see the food description everything so we love to care, give you our food and taste it so pure sri lankan taste without any msg and without any artificial thing you will taste our food Thank you very much, Mr. Suranga, and all the stuff here in Delish Cloud Restaurant. We hope you the best and the most successful in the future. Thank you. Thank you very much. إلى هنا أعزائي المشاهدين نختتم حلقتنا لهذا الأسبوع تابعونا كل جمعة وسبت على قناتكم ABC الخليجية وعلى مواقع التواصل الاجتماعي دمتم بخير وفي أمان الله.